It's mostly new songs, so our first time playing the new record here. These girls have been in New York a little longer than me. I've been a, um, a little more than seven years, and I think even since when I would visit when I was a child that it was like that. Like, I think New York is, in terms of like a creative, like, there's just an energy there that's always moving. I don't think that it's like having a new era. I think it's just continuing with like, but there's always new people and new sort of energy in the city that are making new things. So that's always exciting. I think that since the economy is really crashing and you can definitely feel that in New York, um, I'm kind of wondering slash looking forward to maybe it turning a little bit more into the scene it had in the 80s. It was really interesting and really exciting and I think that in the past few years it's gotten to this kind of gentrification yuppie point where it's been a little bit more difficult to be creative because it was cheaper and then it got more expensive but I think it's going to go back to cheaper a little bit which I think is always good for any city's creative. When people don't have jobs they have more spare time and so they can spend all that time working creatively which I wonder if like every year we're in New York there's about 30 new bands I wonder if now there'll be 50 or 60 new bands <laughs> well I think what most separates us from other bands is the instruments that we use and the fact that we're all women I think it's just a matter of personal taste I don't really know I think there's so many different bands it's hard to even start where we're, how we're different Maybe in the beginning it used to be somewhat difficult because we would show up at venues and people would think that we were just like the sound or the um, you know the merch girls or some bands girlfriends. But I haven't felt that way in a long time. I think people take us pretty seriously and the music, which is great. This new one was actually like very different of an experience because like we weren't we didn't work day jobs at the time, so we had all all of the time to put into the songwriting and um, and we also decided to work with a new producer and we recorded half of it in New York and half in LA. There was a different kind of focus and a different kind of attention that we were able to put into this and also we had been on tour with so many bands and learned so much about keyboards and been on tour with Air and just learned a lot about like finding different sounds that we wanted to create so that we didn't have to make so many layers of sounds. We really knew like exactly what we wanted to have. I feel like it feels a little more rock almost to me because the drums are maybe a little more intense and some of the singing is more just singing instead of quiet stuff. But there is quiet stuff as well. There's so many different things about it. But I. I think the way that this album sounds is the way that we always imagine the other sounding in our heads. So for us, it's more like a realization of what we were trying to accomplish in the first place. I think our success is so surprising to us that every day we just do what happens every day. We get offers to play shows, we get offers to release records, so, so we just do it as it comes. Like, hemos tocado por como cinco años, seis años, y... Y ahora somos nosotras y nada más. Y somos un grupo distinto y todo el mundo conoce a nosotros. Bueno, no todo el mundo, pero bastante gente conoce a nosotros. Y no sé, somos lo que somos. One of the biggest problems that people have, not necessarily if you're in a band, but if you're um, just in life, is setting unrealistic goals instead of just sort of seeing what happens. And obviously you can be ambitious and do your best with what you have, which is what we do, but at the same time, it's really important just to see what happens. You know, I mean, we don't have any goal to like, oh, we definitely need to tour Africa and we need to go see this that we haven't done before. We're just going to do what we can and just enjoy it.